There is no question that being a mother is the most demanding job there is, but at the same time, it's rewarding. It's especially challenging, though, when you have a lot on your plate, like our guest, mother of three, former supermodel, businesswoman, and author, Kathy Ireland, and she's here with some great tips and advice from her new book, Real Solutions for Busy Moms. So happy to meet you. So Thanks for coming Thank in. you. Thank you for inviting me. Great it's, to be here. It's great to have you. You have had such an amazing career so far, and it just keeps getting better. From supermodel to now CEO of a $1.5 billion company, Kathy Ireland Worldwide, tell us a little bit about how the transition from supermodel to CEO happened for you. Well, I always knew I belonged on the other side of the camera. Grateful for that career back in the last century. Did okay, but thank you for your kind words. I, I certainly wasn't super. Uh, I, I did all right. You were to all of us. Well, <laughs> you're very, you're very kind. Uh, but I knew that um, being on the other side of the camera is really where where I belonged, and that's where I wanted to go. I tried and failed at many businesses before starting our own brand in 1993 with a pair of socks. And it was a big celebration when we sold our 100 millionth pair. And I'm so grateful to the women out there who really just turned down the noise of stereotyping and embraced our brand. And I tell people I've got the toughest boss in the world and I love her. It's the moms out there. Our mission statement is finding solutions for families, especially busy moms. And today our team designs and markets over 15,000 products sold in 28 countries. And now you've written a book for all of those moms that you're talking about. And if there was ever a handbook for the overwhelmed busy mom, this is it. It's inspiring and I'm reading it thinking, Kathy's writing this for me and I'm sure a lot of other moms are saying the same thing, but tell us what inspired you to write it. Oh, thank you. I, I wrote the book because I have a lot of problems and I need a lot of solutions. And so do moms out there. We're, we're overwhelmed, we're overstressed over everything, and we need help. So how can the book help? Tell us a little bit about that. The book can help. It's written, first of all, for a busy mom to pick up a book and take the time to read it. That's heroic. That's mm -hmm. huge. It is so hard for us to even finish a project. So the book was written, some people have referred to it as an encyclopedia, but it's written so she can go to the areas of her life which need the most urgent attention at that moment, whether it is financial crisis, whether it is safety for her children. When we're talking about your health, we talk about the health of the family and how important that is. And sometimes moms, we put ourselves last. We're we're nurturers, we're taking care of everybody, and frequently we'll say our family is our priority. We forget that we're a part of that family, too. Speaking of making yourself a priority, you've been talking about this a lot lately and how you weren't necessarily doing that as much. Your son took a picture of you that you said sort of inspired you to make some changes, to eat right, to exercise. Tell me about that picture and what happened. Uh, I, our son got a camera, he's taking pictures, and sweetly, innocently and sweetly, just kind of chuckling. And our five-year-old ran over to him and looked at, you know, what are you laughing at? She's like, Mommy, you look like you're pregnant. Oh, my goodness. And I was like, let me see that. And, and I looked at it, and not so much the weight gain. It was, it was gradual. It creeped up on me, about a pound a year for 25 years. It happens, but especially it, after having kids. It happens, and when your life is so busy and full, you don't make time for exercise. When I was younger, I had a great metabolism, and I loved sports, and I had time to do my sports. But uh, taking care of my health just got lower on the list of priorities. So it's health is what motivates me, and that's the message that I want to share with women. And finally, we're just about out of time, but just tell me very quickly what you would like moms to take away from the book. What I'd like moms to take away is pull your head out of the sand. I call it ostriching. Do not ostrich. Face the tough, the tough stuff that scares you. Don't be intimidating. Is the bank calling to foreclose on your home? Is it credit card debt? Pick up the phone, negotiate and renegotiate. Have that talk with your child. Don't put it off till tomorrow. Do it tonight when you tuck them in. Face your fears, no matter how uncomfortable you are. A little embarrassment today is better than a, a tragedy if we can avoid it. Kathy Ireland, such a pleasure to have you in the studio. You are an inspiration. Thank, Thank you. you so much. And you Thank can you. pick up a copy of Kathy's book, Real Solutions for Busy Moms. It is in bookstores now. And you can find out what is coming up on Parents TV on Twitter. You can follow me at twitter.com slash parentstvjulie.